Circus Variety Show, Sammy and Steve Lanza Jr. Yeah. Hi, thank you guys so much. There he is. My guy right there. Well, that was quite an intro. Uh, yes, and welcome to our first episode, everybody. Number thank one. you. Number one. I'm sure most of you out there will remember us from um, the Abington Cable Access hit show, Abington's Got Talent. Yes, and not to uh, pat our own backs, but we did come in first place. And now we have our own TV show. Yeah, <laughs> to be uh, very clear, those two things are not related. <laughs> so we didn't win this, we just have a platform. Root Beer Circus has gone from a podcast to a award winning band and now a variety show. Yes, and Sammy, tell them the theme of today's episode. April, April Fools! <laughs> no, 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 this is the real show and the theme is April Fool's Day. <laughs> Sammy, did you know? No. That April Fool's Day started in 1563. When you were born? <laughs> when France changed from the Julian calendar to the Gregorian calendar. Um, spelled Julian. Uh, J. You and uh, people didn't get the memo that they had changed from one calendar to the new calendar. Right, so the carrier pigeon wasn't fast enough to yes. tell? And they didn't have texting either. Okay. But the thing was, the Julian calendar had New Year's on the solstice, which is in April. And the Gregorian calendar changed it back to January 1st. So there was people all over France for a good while celebrating New Year's on April 1st. Dummies. Dummies. Bunch of April, April Fools. fools. <laughs> I thought you were going to have Abby. That was embarrassing. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> All those years in clown college, and I'm just stuck in a corner. <laughs> Doing nothing, blowing balloons. What kind of life is this? Not what I imagined. You know, Bozo made it big. But... Kate the Clown? Is that you? Who's asking? Uh, the internet. <laughs> look, 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 look. She's, Whoa! She's perfect for the show. We have a clown for our show? We have a clown for our show! We have a clown for our show! Yeah! Who's the clown for your show? <laughs> you! You! I don't know about that. Wait a minute. Kate, this is perfect. You have a, a corner. Your name's Kate. There's already a sign. And look, the clown is in. The clown is in. Clown's your sign out. says the clown's in. Clown's your in. sign says the clown's in. You have to be on our show. I need a dressing room. I need dental. I I'm need. Getting list. I, I'm getting a list. Go, go, go take care of it. Go take care of it. I'll... Okay. <laughs> balloons. Okay. You know what? Make me something. I, if you can make me one thing, one one legible animal out of this balloon, I will join your little circus, your little root beer circus. <laughs> Earth one? <laughs> Get over here. Give me that. Wait, I want to do. No! <laughs> I want to do things. Okay, okay, okay. What's an animal? What's, I can make whatever you want. What's an animal? You're under pressure here, not me. I can make whatever I want. All right, all right. Are you ready? I don't know if you've ever seen this before. You ever been? Don't say package of hot dogs. Don't. Dressing room is a go. Okay. What else did you need? Dental. Dental. <laughs> nose insurance. Cover my nose. Cover my balloons. I need insurance. Cover your balloons. This is a cable access show. All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, an animal. Hey, babe, what's an animal? Uh, turkey. <laughs> Done. <laughs> Wait, I know, I know, I know. Have her show you how to make an animal, and then you try to just pay attention to her instructions, and then you make the animal. 
So if I prove I'm worthy, I like it. Yeah, right? I like this one. Nose insurance, I'm on it. All right, all right, all right. I got something for you. I'm just gonna show you now, all right? I'm not gonna explain it. Do I need this? No, this? toss it. Snake, I know that one. Everyone's a clown, huh? Everyone wants to be a clown. Everyone wants to be a comedian. That's weird. Praying mantis. Aardvark. Sword. Tiny sword? I know that guy's the earth one. <laughs> Early bird. Or whatever they say. I don't like the way you look at me. <laughs> What do you know? What do you know? A bunch of stuff about April Fools. April Fools. April Fools. April Fools an excuse for you know husbands, boyfriends, girlfriends, themans, whatever to make jokes and you think they're being funny, you think they're being comical, all the sake to be mean, to be mean. That's all it's about. Babe, our show got canceled. <laughs> April Fools. <laughs> But aren't you like, don't you do pranks and silly things all the time? Does that make you mean? <laughs> you don't get paid for thinking. You don't have to hurt me that hard. <laughs> oh, it's a butterfly <laughs> on a stick. Come here. This is a 3-legged butterfly. Babe, <laughs> did you get me a flower? Yeah, I made it myself. Wow. Can you Wow, Casey's gonna be in the show? Casey's gonna be in the show! Casey's gonna be in the show, Woo! everybody! Alright, that's great. Once told me the world is gonna roll me I ain't the sharpest tool in the shed She was looking kinda dumb With her finger and her thumb In the shape of an L on her forehead All the years start coming and they don't stop coming Bent to the rules and I'll hit the ground running Didn't make sense not to live for fun Your brain gets smart but your head gets dumb so much to do, so much to see, so what's wrong with taking the back streets? You never know if you don't go. You never, never shine, shine if you don't, don't go. Hey now, you're an all-star, put your game on, go play. Hey now, you're a rock star, get the show on, get paid. And all that glitters is gold, only shooting stars. Welcome back to the Reaper Circus Variety Show. Yeah. My name's Steve. I'm Sammy. And we have a special guest to interview. So special. Um, he is an intern here at Abington Cable Access. Mm -hmm. Give it up for the one, the only, Demi Benoit, everybody. Give it up for him. There he is. That entrance. That entrance is That was so good, out. that face. Thank you guys for having me. Yeah. Oh, have you ever been April Fooled? Yes, I have. How many times? Plenty of times. Like, I'm, I'm pretty gullible. Yeah? I love that. Do you, do you know like the most uh, potent April Fools you've ever had? Uh, oh, one that comes to mind, my friend, he put whipped cream like all over my locker, like in middle school. So like my, my locker was like just like full of like whipped cream and stuff like that. It was messy and I, I, I got in trouble for it. The headmaster, you know. Ooh. You got in trouble for it? I got in trouble for it. It's his locker. Was I, it the headmaster at Hogwarts? Nah, nah. I want to go to Hogwarts. Though. I do too. Me too. I, I wish I was a magician. 
They have it at uh, Universal Studios. Maybe what, we should all go. What class go. do you think you would be in if you was in Hogwarts? Oh, you mean the house? Yeah, the house. Yeah. Oh, I really, I would love to say Gryffindor, but I'm definitely a Hufflepuff. Yeah. Hufflepuff? I'm for sure a Hufflepuff. The Hufflepuff are humble, you know? You know, they, you know. I love that. That's funny. <laughs> that I really like funny. this guy. I like that. Keep him around. Yeah, we're going to keep him around. If you, could, if you could stick around, thank you. Thank you. Well, thank you guys. Thank you, yeah, Demi, thank for you being so on much. the show. We will be right back after these short messages that will be right here. Let's watch a movie with me. Oh, yeah. Well, well, we did watch movies. Yeah. So this is Bedtime Reviews? Bedtime Reviews. Bedtime yeah. Reviews. This is the segment yep. where we do movie reviews uh -huh. in bed. In bed. Yep. Yep. You woke up real peppy. That's, yeah. that's unlike you. I know. I think I drank coffee before I went to bed. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> What's the first movie we're going to do? The first movie is my favorite movie of all time. What is it? It's my favorite. You're my husband. You're supposed to know my favorite movie of I all know. time. I was just, I was kidding. Oh. What is it? Tell the people. Tell the people? Yeah. You tell the people. Princess Bride. It's the Princess Bride. The Come Princess on, Bride. dog. Sorry. Wait, wait. So let's explain. We're going to review some movies. Yeah. <laughs> Movie review. And based on our reviews, we're going to rate them on a scale of one to ten nuggets. I love it. I love and it. And the first is the Princess Bride. It's the Princess Bride. Let's say, what do you like about the movie? Why I love everything about the movie. It's the greatest your, movie of all time. What's your favorite thing about it? Uh, the story? Yeah, the story's fun. Um, I just, uh, literally what's every the, part the, in my the, head. What's the guy's name? Anigo Montoya. Fezzik. Yes. Dread Pirate Roberts. Um, it is a what's fantasy. What's the big guy? Fezzik. Well, no, what's his real name? Andre the Giant? Andre the Giant's in it. Andre the Giant's yeah. in it. Yes, may he rest in sweet peace. Based on a book? Yes. Okay. But it is a film. It is a film. From the 80s? Yes. Okay. Yep. So you might have been alive. You might have even been alive when it came out. I think I was. I certainly was not. But my dad's cool, so he showed it to me when I was young. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> so it's about a princess who loses the guy that she likes. And um, then she comes in contact with this pirate later on. And you always yell at me when I give spoilers. I don't know how to talk about it without give a spoiler. spoiler away. Spoiler away. <laughs> Well, the pirates are uh, her guy. And, and he, he has this line where he goes, as you wish. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I remember from it. That's, my, that's the line. 
Yeah, so yeah. after he gets her when he's a pirate, yeah. um, he used to say to her, um, as you wish, every time she asked anything, and uh -huh. really that meant, I love you. Uh -huh. As you wish. It is I a love, love story, you. right? It is a it's the greatest love story of all time. Yes, it is. <laughs> so at the end, though, spoilers, uh, they get together happily, yeah, happily ever after. There are rodents of unusual sizes. Yes. There is a fire swamp. Um, there is a miracle man. Um, oh, there's a the guy that goes, inconceivable. Yep. That guy. Yep. There are um, battle of wits. Yeah. There are sword battles. And Igor yeah. Montoya, someone killed his father. So if you're that guy, prepare to die. Not only did someone kill his father, the guy that killed his father had six fingers. On his right hand. On his right hand. Yep. Like this. <laughs> so what do you rate it? Ten chicken nuggets. Ten chicken nuggets? Okay, <gasps> it's a ten piece nugget for me. Um, and I just want to be clear, it's a ten piece nugget for me because it holds a lot of love and nostalgia and as you wish in my heart. Um, I know that you and other people are like, things can't be a 10 because there's always room for improvement. Shut up. It's the greatest movie of all time. 10-piece right. nugget. End. I'm not going to give it a 10-piece nugget. I'm going to give it a 9-piece nugget. Are you giving it a 9-piece nugget because you don't want me to get mad at you? No. Or do you really like the movie I really like the movie a lot. <laughs> I, I like it a lot. But I just can't give it a 10. A 10 is just, there's, there is no 10. So that's our review of yeah. The Princess Bride. Nuggies. I can't believe I'm doing this. I literally cook whole restaurants. This is just, this is, I'm, this is ridiculous. I can't believe I'm doing this my entire life. I'm making sandwiches. This little show, I can't believe this at all. <sighs> hey, it's it's Chef KP Bouget, everybody. Hey, hey how you doing? Oh, hey, how you doing? Huh, I, I'm really excited to be here. Are I'm you? Really, yeah. I, I, I really yeah. am. And I'm, I knew it. Yeah. So I wanted to, you know, I'm, I'm here to make a little bit of, a, you know, more homey dishes that we have at, uh, at home and anyone can make. Oh, We're yeah. going to make it a little bit more interesting, a little bit more uh, fun and exciting for oh, everybody. Oh, that's cool. It's like basic, but with some bougie. Bougie. I like wow. that. Bougie. Yeah. Yeah. Basic bougie. Basic bougie stuff. I like it. Yeah. <laughs> I like it. So we're just going to make something real simple. We're going to make a PB&J. You guys ever have PB&J before? Nope. Uh, no, actually. Never, ne never Never in your that house? That is an actual truth. Oh, real? Oh, okay, so, <laughs> so you didn't have a childhood. That's all right. That's fine. So <laughs> we're going we're gonna to make this little PB&J. We're going to toast it up real nice. Ooh. Okay. And then we're going to just count. Is that some... like the first level of bouche? Yeah, yeah. the first level of bouche is always always have it on a grill. Oh, nice. That's that's kind of like my, my thing for everything. What, um, okay, what about um, soup? Um, I mean, I wouldn't make soup on a grill, but you but, know what? But you just <laughs> said the first level. The first level for any any anyone who doesn't want to have horrible food will be on grill. So soup, no. So uh, uh, bougie people don't have soup. Mm. They don't. Have I soup. think soup is like specifically kind of bougie unless no, well, you're sick. No, yeah. Because I mean, I came here to you, challenge you. you. I came here to yeah, challenge you know, everything you are. You're doing it, and I'm gonna say like you know I don't see a lot of sick people at, oh, more at jelly. clubs. Okay, more of that. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I don't see a lot of them at clubs and bougie and having a great time you know i don't see hospital gowns inside the clubs so you know what i think that's not gonna be something i can really take say that for you, yeah chef? Thank, thank you, you chef. thank you so um, much thanks, can, chef. Talk, can i talk to you yeah absolutely. yeah why don't you go yeah. take care of that um why is he going to hospital clubs i don't know is that a thing no it's i don't i don't know where'd you mm. find this guy <laughs> I don't know. Oh. It, was this planned it was, on a, it was on a yahoo ad a Yahoo ad. Yeah. Oh, do you remember Ask Jeeves? We should ask Jeeves. I should have asked Jeeves. We should just let's start asking. <laughs> yeah, I should ask him. It's bullshit time. Well, we're really excited to try this uh, fancy. P, B, and J. That's what you called it, right? Fancy times. Yeah. Gotta, gotta, I called it bougie. That's what I called oh, it. Oh, sorry. That's right. Yeah, you, you, gotta, right. you gotta make sure, you know, and 
And I want to make sure that you guys understand, you know. We like go, the diagonal, I, just like I like it. I know. Yeah. We want to make sure you guys love every bit that you have. Oh, yeah. You know, but I want to make sure that you guys understand, you know, this is the kind of kind of cooking I expected to give you guys. So why don't you grab a bite? Okay. You know, that PB&J Yeah. Only. Ooh, it's nice and toasted. It is nice. It really is nice and toasted. Hey, cheers. Cheers. Here we go. And April Fool's, there's some bananas in it. Oh. Yeah, you didn't like that, did you? But it's okay. That's what April Fools is about, you know. He so, got us. I got, I got. You know, I was waiting all day for that. I was, that was, that was worrying me all day. I didn't see this. him, see him put the banana in there. Did you? I don't like peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. 